In northern Israel, a Catholic parade thanks God for protecting the image of Virgin Mary. Today, it's these Christians who feel they need protection. These extremists, whether Muslim, whether Jews, is raising more and more. We are afraid because uh, there was an escalation, very dangerous escalation. That escalation is of hate crimes against Christians in Israel. In this Jerusalem church, the words Jesus is garbage was scrawled on the side wall. At the Vatican's Jerusalem headquarters, recent graffiti threatened death to Arabs and Christians and all those who hate Israel. The church believes the perpetrators are ultra-nationalist Orthodox Jews. Outside the site, believed to be both King David's tomb and the Last Supper room, they protest a rumor the building will be handed over to the Vatican. If someone will give up one inch from that tomb, they'll start a war between Jews and Christians. God would forgive us. Israeli police must protect everyone equally, and they say they're trying to protect Christians. Action has been taken in the past. Uh, by police operations as well as undercover operations, not just the Israeli National Police, but also secret security services who have also been involved. That's how seriously we're taking and dealing with those incidents. But the church believes this isn't only about police. The Holy Land's top Catholic official says some Israeli schools teach hate. Some Israeli politicians preach exclusions. As the Pope arrives, some Christians living in what they consider the holiest place on earth say they feel neither welcome nor protected.